The stress. A humiliating 7 3 defeat. But Roy Coyle has injected some new enthusiasm and spirit into Glen Torrent, who took a second half lead. Stuart Elliott's goal, Andy Kirk made sure. The Glens, who have the second best defensive record in the league, only conceding 23 goals in their 23 matches, let Portadown back into the match. Vinnie Arkins headed in an equaliser eight minutes from time. And with just two minutes left, Arkins' striking partner, Gary Haylock, thought he'd stolen the three points. The woodwork denied the win, but Glentoran weren't finished yet. And in a nail-biting finish as Portadown failed to gain possession in midfield, Andy Kirk raced through to score a winner for Glentoran in the last minute of the game. Glentoran continue their steady climb up the table. Overall, I thought we deserved it. Uh, we had much uh, of the better in the first half, and uh, the second half as well. Uh, we contained them to, to very, very few opportunities. And it was nice to get the, the goal when we got it at the end, which was difficult to come back from. It was very quick, and we were lucky to get off with the Haylock chance, but when it's your day, it's, it's meant to be like, so what we'll do is look forward to next week.